Hi, hello everyone. How are you? Today we are going to discuss about another question for MRCS regarding EMRCS. We will also discuss the different part of the uh, questions such as uh, uh, recalls, Fauzia sheets, and other questions. And we will discuss uh, the topics regarding the MRCS. So let's have a start the question here. Which of the following muscle is not within the posterior compartment of the lower leg? So here they are saying which muscle not in case of posterior compartment. So we have to find out uh, the posterior compartment of the leg muscle. The posterior compartment of the leg muscle. First we have to identify the lower leg muscle which lies in the posterior compartment here options are you can see here options are peroneus brevis flexor digitorum longus soleus popliteus flexor hallucis longus so here uh, are the five options peroneus brevis flexor digitorum longus soleus popliteus flexor hallucis longus so in these options we have to find out which of the muscle is not lies in the posterior compartment of the leg so first we have to find out what are the muscles which lies in the posterior compartment of the lower leg so let's start so here the posterior compartment of the leg or lower leg the posterior compartment of the leg has superficial compartment and deep compartment and we know that the lower leg also have the anterior compartment and lateral compartment so here superficial posterior compartment deep posterior compartment anterior compartment and lateral compartment so leg lower leg contains four compartment it is very very important for mrcs question or mrcs exam so here superficial posterior compartment of the leg deep posterior compartment of the leg anterior compartment of the leg and lateral compartment of the leg so in case of lower leg there are four compartment so here first of all we see in the superficial posterior compartment they contain three muscles the muscles are gastrocnemius soleus and plantaris gsp gsp so here gastrocnemius soleus and plantaris in deep group there are four muscles they are flexor hallucis longus flexor digitalis longus tibialis posterior and popliteus so total seven muscle in case of posterior compartment three superficial and four deep superficial are gastrocnemius soleus plantaris that means the mnemonic is gsp and deep flexor hallucis longus, flexor digitalis longus, tibialis posterior, and popliteus. So, here we can see this superficial group of posterior compartment of the lower leg. Here we can see this muscle, the gastrocnemius. Here we can see this muscle. This is gastrocnemius, it is one of the superficial muscle. Then, GSP, then S for soleus gastrocnemius soleus and another one is plantaris this muscle here we can see the tendon fiber it is long and it arises from the uh, side of the popliteus portia. this muscle this is the plantaris muscle so the superficial groups muscles are of the posterior compartment are gastrocnemius soleus and plantaris the mnemonics is gsp gsp and deep deep muscles of the posterior compartment they are these muscles they are tibialis posterior flexor digitorum longus flexor hallucis longus and popliteus so three plus four they are totally seven they are tibialis posterior flexor digitorum longus flexor hallucis longus and popliteus uh, from there we also can see the other aspect but we um, from uh, for this we see 
the another picture about this muscle here we can see this muscle this is the plantaris this two head of the gastrocnemius and soleus gastrocnemius soleus plantaris they are superficial group and these muscles these four muscles are deep muscle they are popliteus tpl is posterior flexor hallucis longus and flexor digitorum longus total seven muscle in the posterior compartment superficial four superficial three deep four here we can see the compartment of the lower leg the posterior compartment already been uh, read now the anterior compartment anterior compartment has four important muscles they are tibialis anterior extensor digitorum longus extensor hallucis longus and peroneus tertius and the lateral compartment peroneus longus and brevis the lateral compartment contain the fibula and the fibularis longus and brevis or peroneus longus and brevis the peroneus muscle also called the fibularis muscle so here the posterior compartment we can see here the uh, muscles are flexor group flexor flexor but anterior compartment they are extensor group extensor and it is here another important uh, moment to remember that the peroneus longus that means fibularis longus fibularis brevis their lateral compartment on the other hand peroneus tertius or fibularis tertius this is anterior compartment so we have to be very careful in this option peroneus tertius it lies which compartment anterior compartment peroneus longus and brevis it lies which compartment it lies lateral compartment so here here we can see the lateral compartment here there are two important muscles they are fibularis longus here and fibularis brevis or it is peroneus longus and peroneus brevis they lies in the lateral part along the fibula and they inserted into the foot bones so lateral compartment contain only two muscle fibularis longus or peroneus longus fibularis brevis or peroneus brevis so here we can see the anterior compartment we uh, saw that the anterior compartment contains four muscles they are here at first of all here it is the tibialis anterior extensor digitorum longus the in the lower part they divided into uh, the digitorum part then extensor hallucis longus it goes to the uh, Uh, medial aspect then peroneus tertius so these four muscles are anterior compartment and here the peroneus tertius it is anterior compartment it is great concern to remember so here anterior compartment so finally we can see that the anterior compartment anterior compartment has the four muscle lateral compartment it contain three muscle and posterior compartment it contain three plus four total seven so anterior compartment four muscle lateral compartment two muscle and posterior compartment three plus four seven muscle so these muscle will have to remember for the purpose of mrcs exam so here we can see the peroneus brevis we know that peroneus brevis it lies in the lateral compartment of the leg so our final answer peroneus brevis which is not a content of posterior compartment of the leg thank you all